Welcome back to NGTV Play Super Smash Brothers Melee, featuring myself, <clears throat> Spencer, my co-host, Matt. I'm playing as Marth, Matt's playing as Falco. We're here live on Shirts.tv slash Nearthal Gaming TV. Midway through, we're doing a best of five. I don't want to do that. I wanted to roll. Oh, nice shine back here. You don't get those very often. Is that Sands from Undertale? No. Just like a cool bird skin. There is some Undertale music in this, but we had to take it out because it was getting content ID match. Oh, on YouTube, yeah. Yep. times where a slow getup kind of helped me out there for a second at least does my down still have a tipper hit yes your whole every move that you have has a tipper hit is there a tip of the sword in the move then yes You know what Marth could do with? Huh. One hit that's a kick. Just to like. Why well, isn't the DK rap 2018 available on the soundtrack on here? There is a DK rap on that stage, actually. Yeah. We have it set. We haven't had it today yet, though. Yeah, it usually shows up at least once every stream. To shorten it. Oh, we did have it today. Nice. Oh. Yeah, we have a rotation of music that happens on each stage, so keeps it interesting. gaming channel also in the NFL gaming it is yeah it's actually gaming tv uh in the in the panels or the information there is a there's a link to our youtube channel he's on mobile then it might be yeah you have to go under information to find it a bit difficult yeah 
And if you just search Neanderthal Gaming TV, YouTube will try to correct you to Neanderthal Space Gaming Space TV. Tell it to F off and just do Neanderthal Gaming TV. Stupid YouTube. Oh, I missed that fucking tech because I did it too soon. I did the fox timing. The link has been found. Nice. I knew that you were too low for that to be super effective. You're tricky. Too high of a laser. Make me shield. That's definitely what your plan was, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Damn it, Falco. Spread your wings. Also, accidentally forward aired instead of down aired. Oh, is that what happened? Okay, that makes more sense now. How come the chimp can fly, but the bird needs a spaceship? These are the real fucking questions right here. Mm hmm. Sakurai.
I guess the chimp has a jetpack, but still. Yeah, the bird, the bird has wings. Here's a question for you guys. Who should I be rooting for? Uh, probably Spencer. I'm the underdog. Matt tends to win. We can root for Matt if you want. I mean, not a lot of people root for, like, directly root for Matt, because they usually expect him to win. <laughs> so it's like a, can Spencer do it? type thing than anything else. See, there's still goals with Matt, though. So it's like, okay, he probably, you know, he has a high chance of winning because he has a good record against Spencer, me. But also, um... You know, you could be like, oh, well, uh, let's hope Mac, Mac gets a four stock or <laughs> there's still goals. Spell cancel. Mm. Yeah, let me change my name real quick too to, to get rid of all the games I want. <laughs> so the turns have tabled. No. No, I'll start. You follow me. My God. I'm bad at rhythm. Only thing you'll be winning. <laughs> you might have, you might win the games, but I win the RPS sometimes. All right, best of five, game one, battlefield up, oh, uh, final decision. I'm I'm Spencer, this is Matt. Yeah.
suckering sucker tash. Weapon. I was trying to be careful on all this shit and it didn't do anything. <laughs> Fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah, I could tell you're trying uh, very, uh, very hard to not get a uh, fuck there. Yeah. What is a tech? Just wondering. Uh, teching is um, so. Uh, it's also referred to as uh, uh, it, it's related to L canceling. So when you hit your shield button. Um, just before you you land after getting hit um you'll tech is what it's called and you can input a direction so that's how when you see people after they get hit really hard and they land and immediately roll that's teching um and you can either tech in place which is just with with no direction where you just stand right back up again or you can tech in a direction where you'll roll either left or right um and then l canceling is the same action of hitting the shield just before you hit the ground but instead, it's after doing a an aerial move, um, and that's how people do uh, like forward airs and back airs and down airs faster, without having to wait for the lag of landing. Yeah, um, there is no L canceling in Ultimate though. There's no Only L canceling in in, uh, in Smash Four as well. Is there L canceling in Brawl? No. Yeah, so it's just a melee. It's a melee specific tech. Although teching um, after getting hit is in all the games. So but that's essentially what it is you just press the shield button just before you hit the ground yeah um okay battlefield game two what's attack and ultimate it's the same thing uh you just after you get hit and you're about to hit the ground hit or the wall. shield button yeah Like that. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, Matt just like stood right back up again after hitting the ground. That's teching. And it's a it's a tight timing usually. And if you do it too early you get locked out of it. Yeah, so you can't just mash the, the button, you have to hit it the right time. But I think it was like a window where if you hit it like any time within like I don't know thirty frames or something like that. Um, you can't do it again for that period. Unless it was successful, I think, right? Yeah. That fucking tap jump, dude. Sounds useful. It is super useful. It's also useful to mix it up too, because you can purposely miss the tech, and that's and that changes the timing of when you're going to roll. Or, and also, if you miss the tech, you have the option of doing a get up attack, which is when you're laying down and then you you attack as you're getting up, just like when you're on a ledge and you, you do a get up attack. But you can only do that if you miss the tech. Also, some strategies are built around expecting somebody to tech. That's why mm -hmm. it's called tech chasing. So you like kind of try to read whether or not they're going to roll a particular direction and then be there ready when their, their roll is finished. 
Take a <laughs> take a real quick beer back. All right, see you when you're back. <laughs> Yeah, I go back to Battlefield. Game three. Shouldn't have rolled. thinking. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't think you did, yeah. God damn it, dude. I'm A mango dash dancing. Are you just like dash dancing their shield? And they're like, oh, fuck. He's, I don't know what he's doing, dude. You know really bad about that is like, I didn't even notice that you're doing that. I'd say no, I wasn't paying attention. All right, game one, but uh, finally, I almost said Battlefield again. Final destination, um, two minutes and 16 seconds. I took one stock. You had 16 initial ones. I had seven, five counters. I had seven. You had one beneficial trade. You had 355 inputs per minute. I had 260, 226. You came with a neutral B at back air, forward smash, and a down air. I killed you with the down air. You had a 64% combo on my first stock, a 61 followed by 39% combo on my second stock. A 38% combo on my third stock. And nothing on my last stock. You see, this is the, the beneficial was. trade right here. 46 seconds in.
Oh, and it says trade right there as well. Oh, mine. Well, I got the beneficial trade, so. No, I know. I know. It's, I'm saying, like, you know, it says it on both of ours, which is interesting. But 46 seconds in. So that would be 7 minutes and 13 seconds when that happens, I want to say. I thought you were going to roll. Yeah. I'll get a side B one more time. All right, we're getting there. We both did 10 percent damage to each other. That was the beneficial trade. I back aired you and you back aired me. Or did you near me? Oh, I think I back aired. All my down air kills were out of a up tilt. Hell yeah, brother. It's like the, the alley-oop, the scoop and dunk. Yeah. The whole scoop and dunk. Uh, game two, battlefield, two minutes and 55 seconds. I took one stock again. You had 16 inch ones. I had seven, 10 counter at side 11. Your inputs were 337 per minute. Mine were 242. It came with a back air, down air, down smash, and a down air. I killed you with a forward smash. You had a 42% combo on my first stock. A 40% followed by a 43% combo on my second stock. I had a 35% combo on your second stock, and no other combos. Game three, Battlefield, two minutes and 30 seconds. I took three stocks. Um, you had 12 neutral ones, I had seven, eight counter hits, I had eight. You had one beneficial trade. You had 317 inputs per minute, I had 281. You came with a back air and three forward smashes, and I killed you with a back air, you killed yourself, and then I killed you with a side B. I think it was also just a kill yourself moment, too. Yeah. Um, you had a 38% combo followed by a 36% combo on my first stock. I had a 35% combo on your first stock. And then I had a 43% combo on your second stock, and then you had a 41 on my last. Yeah, that was rough. Yeah. I mean, I noticed you weren't really trying to get out of combos. Like, I would, like, shine you way up and then, or, like, send you up or something, and then you would just kind of, like, float back down and land in my, you know, down air. So I was getting a lot of kills, kind of just, like, That's what you meant when you said I was being lazy. Mm -hmm. Cause I think the ending of that battlefield game you could have lived if you just like done anything at all instead of just I don't remember how it ended, what happened. I threw you up or I shined you and you were super high and then you kinda just flowed down and I dared you. But hmm. I think I might have been trying to time a uh, swing at you. That's what you're saying. I need to stop doing that. Like, I always feel like I can get away with it, and sometimes I do. And it's, a, it's not a bad option. Like, it, it bats you away, right? But it, it has everything to do with spacing and timing. And if you don't get the right spacing and timing, then it's not going to come out, or it's not going to matter. Um, because I need to be able to hit you before you do your attack with enough distance to not get hit by it if it happens to come out. Um, but I just need to be focusing because, like, nobody does that. It's very rare that somebody comes down and hits when they, when they come down. They just return to the stage in the, as qu quickly as they can. Yeah. And I'm always trying to, like, fight. Counter hit. Yeah. But I just, I just think it's going to work. And if it works this time, sick, I'm in a good position. But like, why? I don't voluntarily reset to neutral very often. I think that's my problem. Well, it's a problem.
Yeah. And also against Falco, it's 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 hard to, to play a grounded game. Um, because you short hop stuff way more often as Falco than you do as a fox when you're coming in. You're always in the air, so like my down tilt stuff doesn't quite work in the same way because you're more likely to be in the air about to laser or hit me. Um, so I was trying to replace it with like maybe fainting into a crouch and then do a forward tilt, and I got that maybe once or twice. And then, but for some reason, my execution, I just end up doing down tilts sometimes. Or I do like a dash attack, which wasn't terrible. Not what I wanted to do though. Because I feel like to beat that, it, it would be the ground and move that would work would be forward tilt to bat you away if you're coming in with a down air. Yeah. It's just an example of like how you can't just mindlessly like do like a strategy, like run up down tilt or anything like that because. You have to play around what's happening. So I was, I was trying to problem solve that, but wasn't getting it quite like super well. Um, and then also you were just killing me. It's it's crazy because sometimes I like I would just look and be like, oh shit, I'm on my last stock. Like I had no idea what happened on my previous stocks. It was gone. Welcome back. back. Welcome back. Do you have any thoughts? Um... No. Falco was playing good. Name for the episode? Sleepy Boy Lazy Marth? Sure. <laughs> All right, so we're going to call this an episode. For those of you on the stream, we're not going offline. We have a timer in the bottom left so we can turn these into episodes for YouTube, so stick around. We have another episode coming up after this. For those of you on YouTube, check us out live on twitch.tv slash and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.